<laughs> Fuck, so I don't care how old you are. I don't care. Nice fit. <laughs> Another dock bass. Hey folks, again, welcome to this week's Northland Fisherman. I'm on Big Stone Lake. I'm fishing Whistler jigs with coarse swim baits. We had a big blowout here yesterday and the walleyes on Big Stone move shallow and a Whistler jig with that swim bait is a great way to target aggressive fish when they're shallow. This week, however, it's all about the inland opener in Minnesota. This is a border water, so it's already open, but across most of Minnesota, the walleye season opens this Saturday. Here's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be on Otter Tail Lake. Otter Tail Lake in central Minnesota has a really good population of walleyes. What I like to do is I like to target fairly shallow water. I'm talking a six to ten foot drop-offs. I'll get on the first drop-off drop -off out from shoreline. I'll move along looking for small points and turns, maybe some emergent vegetation, weed growth, and that's where those walleyes will be. I like to use a jig and a spot tail shiner. However, the jig that I use, well, it's the same jig that I'm using today. It's the Whistler jig, except I'll bait it with the spot tail shiner. And the advantage of this bait is it's got that little propeller blade. It's something different. It's a little flash, a little vibration that does a great job of attracting and triggering bites. A lot of people will use a spot tail shiner and just a jig, but that Whistler jig with that added propeller blade is a great way to do something different and get some extra bites on the walleye opener. I'm gonna be on Otter Tail Lake. Here's where Tony Roach is gonna be. Hey, I'm Tony Roach. I love Minnesota fishing opener. It's just one of those times of year that's special to me, you know, to get together with family before I kick off my guide season. We spend the entire weekend fishing on the front end. We fish crappies, have a great big fish fry. It's just really a family event. But for the actual opener, I'll be out on Mille Lacs Lake. It's uh, one of those traditions that we do every single year, me and my dad, and now my son will be out there with us. And what I love about Mille Lacs Lake is it's an incredible shallow water pitching bite. One of my favorite baits to throw out there is a swim bait. And Northland has the new core swim baits that work excellent. You couple that with like a swim head jig or their new current cutter jig, it's an absolute deadly presentation. And you can fish extremely shallow. I tend to start in that four, six, even eight feet of water, pitching the shallow rocks, the weeds. And really what I like doing with these baits is casting them out and then just simply letting them hit the bottom and as soon as they hit the bottom, instead of just swimming that bait back to the boat, I like to do a pitch and rip. That works extremely well in Mille Lacs. A lot of those fish are feeding on crayfish, uh, bait fish on the bottom, darters, and it just seems that pitch and rip, especially this time of year, adding that pause puts a lot of fish in the boat. It's just a fun way to fish on opener, especially this year with it being a little bit warmer than normal. When you get temps into those mid 50s, those fish are extremely aggressive and they're gonna be snapping. Hi, I'm Brad Hawthorne with Northland Fish and Tackle. And opener's a big deal around Minnesota. I mean, it's, it's family tradition for a lot of us. And this year, I would like to split it up. Some years I open up on Mille Lacs, and other years I open up on Cutfoot Sioux Winnie area. And this year is the year I'm gonna be heading up to Cutfoot Sioux and Winnie. And the approach up there over the years has been simple for me. A shiner, an RZ jig, in either eighth or quarter ounce, and you simply pitch it behind the boat, put the trolling motor down, and go between 0.3 and 0.5 miles an hour until you run into the fish. Now Winnie's such a diversified body of water that you can fish in cut foot Sioux in the shallow areas and if the fish aren't there, if we have a warm, a warm spring, you can simply go right out to the mouth on Big Winnie and still get into a lot of walleyes guys. So again I'm Brad Hawthorne with Northland Fish and Tackle. Enjoy your Minnesota fishing opener. Come back a couple hours later another big fish has actually moved into that spot. There's one. <laughs> 